Hello, this is the Pharaoh with USAstroJacks.com and APClub.net. Today, we're getting back to the basics, and we're going to be working on the Venus. The Venus is a trick that is actually pretty easy to do. I classify it as one of the, the first beginner trick you should learn right after you have mastered horizontal orbits and vertical orbits. Okay, so the way we're going to do this today is I'm going to show you how to do the trick, then I'll break it down. I'll break it down in a two-step process and then a continual process. Okay, here's the trick. I'm going to start off with the two-step process. I lied. It's a one-step process. Let's do it again. Okay. Here's what happens. You start with holding the jack, the single end ball in your dominant hand, and throw it into a vertical orbit. So the other end ball is coming towards your dominant hand. Okay. So. The way you start into this trick is you give a tug of the string so the end ball comes over your dominant hand and rests like this. So as you notice, I have a string coming around my wrist going up to where I'm holding it in my dominant hand. That's the first half. The first half of the trick is getting your end ball to come up and over your wrist. Okay? Now, what should happen is for a small, your palm should be facing up, so the string is coming down, okay? So in order to do the second part of the trick, which is to get the center ball to go up and over your wrist, what you're going to do is you're going to swing when you're starting. This is how you start to learn this trick. You swing the center ball until you get enough momentum, then while turning your wrist over, you send the center ball back over your wrist and back into the orbit, okay? So let's break that down one more time. End ball comes over the wrist, palm facing up, get some momentum, turn your wrist over and bring that center ball over, okay? So that's the two-step process. Now, for when you've, when you've mastered the two steps independently, let's put it all together. This is how it looks when everything's all together. Okay? So, obviously you're speeding all your motions up. So, it's essentially the same thing, except you're doing it all at once. No, not all at once, just in very rapid succession. So, over the wrist. So, you, it's a good idea to keep your, your palm facing up when you're starting this. So that it goes over, 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 okay? So this is where you want to get to. When you know you've mastered this trick, is when you can essentially do Venuses like this for about as long as you want, okay? So one more time, everything all put together. End ball, center ball. End ball, center ball, okay? So it's all based on momentum and tension. Momentum getting the center ball and tension so you're guiding the center ball over with your dominant hand, okay? Now, I wanna go into something a little more advanced. This is called the infinite Venus, okay? So I kinda like to call this one the continual Venus, but once you really start getting the hang of the Venus, you're able to go like that. You're able to get it to continuously go around your wrist. Now, the way you do this is you're actually concentrating on the center ball. You're concentrating on the momentum of the center ball. So your motion is continually bringing the center ball over your wrist and the end ball is going for a ride. Okay, let me show it one more time. So you are worried about the center ball and don't care about the end ball. Okay? Alright, that is the infinite Venus. And that is how you do 
Well, that's how you do a Venus in a couple variations. Now as a bonus, I want to show you why I absolutely love the Venus. Now the Venus to me is a wonderful linking trick. You can start off with a vertical orbit, you can do a Venus and get into a good number of positions. Okay? If you've noticed in my videos, I actually use the Venus a lot. Because they, you can grab the center ball, you can grab the end ball and go into some pong, or you can even go into that rebound combo right there. So, that was my little bonus showing a lot of different things you can do with the Venus. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, continue ad adding comments, like it, comment on it. Thank you much and have a good day.